it's Jazz Rose and welcome to a trendy AliExpress clothing haul. This big boy is full of clothes that I purchased in March. The last thing came yesterday. It's now June. Drop it. I love doing these brutally honest clothing hauls. I, it's my favorite kind of haul to do. And with this stuff being from AliExpress, the quality is not going to be the best. I haven't tried this stuff on, but I have opened most things. Everything that I show in this haul will be linked in the description, as well as the price and the size. Before I get into it, if you like the look of my t-shirt that I'm wearing, it is from my clothing brand, Moody Monday. Go check it out. I love this design, this one's my favorite. I've got a bunch of things on the website now. I've got beanies, I've got t-shirts, I've got hoodies, I've got jumpers. So the link will be down below, go check it out. It would mean so much to me. First thing I have to show is this UNIF jumper, but it is not from UNIF because the original one is like $150. I really wanted this jumper, so I found it on AliExpress. I think this was like, $25. But when I first opened this, I noticed that it's pretty cropped. So maybe it was made to be tucked into something. This, I don't think this is something that I would wear out of the house because people would laugh at me, but it'd be good for an Instagram photo. All right, well, I'm gonna try this on and hopefully it's not too disgusting. <laughs> what the hell is this? You can't even see it, hang on. What the hell? Look at the sleeves, they're really short. Do I have really long arms? <laughs> but this, this is way too short. I reckon it'd look good tucked into some like mum jeans or a tight skirt. I'm wearing trackies right now. It, it's not a good look. The jumper itself is probably gonna look cute on somebody else. The sleeves are nice and big. They're just not long enough. I feel like a child. When you're not seeing the bottom half, it looks all right, but I still wouldn't wear it out in public. But hey, for the quality, it's actually really good quality. I don't know what the original one feels like, but there's not much you can really do with wool. Quality wise, it's great. The embroidery is good as well. I just, I think it needs to be a little bit bigger. <laughs> Next thing I have to show is a crop top from Zaful. Zaful has an AliExpress store. I, if you're an OG subscriber or if you've just gone through my old videos, you may have seen that I had bought from Zaful before and it was the worst shopping experience of my life. I hated it. I bought three things. One thing showed up. I didn't even get my money back for the other two. The customer service was horrible. The quality of the thing I received was the worst. And I vowed to never shop there again. But I saw some cute things on their AliExpress store. So, whatevs. So I got an apron, I guess. I don't like tops that I have to tie up myself because I can't do it. I don't think this is a top that I could wear with no bra because the back is very low. I think it's a cowl neck top. This is the design on it. I love the color. It's like a satin material. Definitely needs an iron. The quality is all right. I just want to see how it fits and I'll probably need some help. So I might be like five minutes. <laughs> um, right, so the front is okay. I could not tie up the back myself. I think I stuffed it up, <laughs> but it's definitely a top that you need to go braless with and I can't do that this isn't working for me <laughs> this next dress oh god I actually got a refund for this because it never arrived and I just got an automatic refund um, and then like a week later it came I didn't realize that I paid $50 for this I'm so happy I got a refund. This is not, like looking at it now, this is not worth $50. And after I bought it, I thought I'd have a look at the customer photo reviews. 
and they just they didn't look too good on the customers it's a long sleeve white dress with some floral prints i didn't realize the neck had this frilly detail which looks really gross and it's not really my style i don't know how this is gonna look on me i'm kind of dreading it but let's do it <laughs> no <laughs> this is gross i look old so this this is something and then i'll show you something else the sleeves are not full length they're like half or three quarter i don't know i don't care it's very short you can't even see the bottom Whee! <laughs> let's just say i cannot wear this on a windy day or even a not windy day because it's so short a car driving past me would blow this dress up This next one is another thing that I got from Zaful. It is a leopard dress. Oh god, and it's very wide. I think it's meant to be a cow neck. So this is a bodycon mini dress and it has a slit on this side. Oh, both sides. It's got a slit on both sides. I have a feeling this would look horrible on me but it might look good with a t-shirt underneath so I'll try that. Okay, first thing I noticed, this is not a dress that you should wear with a bra because it goes down very low the straps are in the worst place see where my bra straps are that should be where this strap is but it look just falls straight off my shoulder i don't know how well i can show you but the length oh my god my camera is the worst the length is good it covers my bum really well i think this would look a lot better if it was a bit tighter to like shape the waist instead of it just looking straight i do have to say the quality is very soft it's so stretchy i just i can't wear it this next item is Oh my god, look at that. It's a formal dress. I bought a formal dress. Stop falling off straps. Okay, this looked really good on customers um, who have like submitted their photos. It's boned at the front. Very stiff boning, so that's good. It's kind of like off the shoulder. It looked really nice, okay. It has some weight to it as well. I mean, that's probably what you should expect when buying a boned formal dress, but yeah. All right, I'm gonna stop talking. Look how strong that bony is. <laughs> I cannot zip this dress up. It's a bit too small, but you can, you can see what it was meant to be. It would look better if it was zipped up because this looks a bit too wide, but this is the little slit. It goes up very high. This looks like the kind of dress that you would buy from a costume shop. Yuck! This next item I have already put on. I've already worn in an Instagram photo. I didn't buy these for the video. I bought them to pair with something else I had. I did get a refund for these because they looked nothing like the photo and the seller was like, oh yeah, true, and gave me my money back. <laughs> I hate these pants, but I'm gonna show you what they look like. As you can probably see, they're a little bit tight, like a size too small, super tight around my thighs. My fat is hanging out. The back goes down way too low. It shouldn't be going down this low and then up this high. The length is good. <laughs> The length is really good, but I hate these pants. So next product. <laughs> this is a hoodie. It is the worst quality hoodie I have ever felt. And I cannot believe this was like $25. It is incredibly light. The print feels like plastic. It's very see-through, like looking at it like this, I can see the logo through the back. And it's it's thick, but I don't get why it's still so light and see-through. Okay, I hate this. It's really small, like really cropped. The arms are short, no surprise there. This is how short it is. If I lift my arms up, that's so short. Okay, at least the hood is big. I have a few more things to try on. This next one is some kind of dress. 
It's something, all right? This is a mini dress. Why does it have to be cow neck? Oh my God. With Renaissance art on it. Oh, look at that. There's a penis on the back. Why? Why not just take out all the penises? I don't want to wear this now. Are there any boobs? Yep, there's boobs. That same photo is printed like five times all over it. Yay! Oh, this fits so well. I really like the shape of this dress and the straps are adjustable, so that's good. Just wish it didn't have penises on it. I really like this. I love the ruched detail and you can adjust it with these pull strings. This is really nice. I really like it. I think this might be my favorite one so far. Just the print is horrible. <laughs> Is another dress I'm pretty sure this was a motel dress or they had like something really similar but it's a velvety material and it has butterflies on it the straps aren't adjustable they're just sewn on material this is just a plain old bodycon dress and it's probably gonna be a don't wear with a bra product just my luck. I haven't even finished pulling it up yet and it's already come past my bum. Oh, I look disgusting and feel it too. This would be good if you are petite, but I am not. It's super tight, so I think that's how it was meant to be anyway. But it is incredibly short. I don't know how well you can see, but it's way too short. I cannot wear this. These last two items I bought from the same seller. They are meant to be a set. You can wear them separately, like you could choose to buy them separately. But this is a mesh top with stars. And this is a green velvet mini dress. Not gonna lie, this looks like costume velvet. You know, that like really cheap velvety feel and material. Feels like that. Look at me, ooh. The top and the dress fit me perfectly the top is a bit itchy i don't think i would wear this outfit out because it looks a bit cheap but i actually really like this i'll show you the rest of it the dress fits me really well it's not too tight it's not too loose the straps are fine it has this slit on the side the length is really good it covers my bum fully i really like it way to end on a good note i like that Okay, well that was everything that I got from AliExpress. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I will definitely never stop shopping in AliExpress. I love it for so many reasons, especially wigs. Wigs are really good from there. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Comment below what your favorite item from this haul was. And if you wanna see a certain kind of video from me, then let me know as well. And if you wanna see more of my videos, make sure to subscribe. If you're not already, that will really mean a lot to me. And until next time, goodbye.